it's phonics time with Freddy Fox. What's inside Mrs Chester's box? Shall we have a look and see what's in the box today? Oh, hold on. Do you think Freddy's in there? I think he might be. He is. It Freddy, what on earth have you got on your nose? Oh, Freddy said he's not Freddy Fox today. He's somebody else. Who do you know that has a red nose? Someone that you might see at Christmas time. That's right. Are you Rudolph? Are you Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer? Freddy, I do like your red nose. I don't know. Shall we have a look and see if Freddy's got a bag for us today? I think he has. Oh, it's a great big bag today. I wonder whether Freddy's Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer has got anything to do with our bag today. Shall we have a look and see what's inside? Come on then. Right then. Oh, this is an interesting one. Does anybody know what that is? Yes, it's a radio. You can hear music or stories. Radios are really good. Some people have a radio on their phone. But Freddie's got a little radio here. Let's see what else we've got in the bag. Oh, now then. I wonder, have any of you been to play tennis over the last few weeks when it's been really nice weather? You might have used a racket, a tennis racket. Pop the racket down. What else is in here, Freddy? Oh, now I know lots of children who like to eat these. Who likes to eat raisins? I like raisins too. We've got some raisins to go with our radio and our racket. Pop them down over there. Who else is in the bag? Let's see. Oh, we've got a little rabbit. Is that your friend, is it? A little rabbit. Let's pop the rabbit down by the raisins. I hope he doesn't eat them all. I wonder... Is there anything else? Oh, there is. Now then, I wonder, does anybody know what this is? Let me show you a bit closer. Yes, it's called a ruler. You can use a ruler to measure things or to draw really straight lines. That's a ruler. Put the ruler down over here. Anything else, Freddy? Oh, yes, now. If any of you have been to the zoo, you might have seen an animal like this. Can you tell me what it's called? Did you say rhino? That's right, it's a rhino or a rhinoceros. That's the posh name for it, isn't it? A rhino, he's got a horn there on the end of his nose. There's a rhino. I think we've got some baby rhinos at the zoo, haven't we? What else have we got in here? Oh, Freddy, <laughs> there's your friend. There's your friend Rudolph. I think you've got his red nose though, haven't you today? Pop our reindeer called Rudolph over there. We've got lots of things, haven't we today? Now then, sometimes if you're doing some drawing and you think, oh, I'm not sure whether I like that bit there, you can use a rubber to rub it out with. Or you might have done some writing as well and you can rub your writing out. That's called a rubber. Pop the rubber there. Have we got anything else in here, Freddy? We have. Now, I know lots of little girls who have ribbons in their hair. They're very pretty ribbons, Freddy, aren't they? Beautiful ribbons. Let's put those down. Anything else, Freddy? We have got something. Oh, <gasps> wow! It's a rocket. Can you count down from 10 with me and we'll blast off the rocket. Are you ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Blast off. Wow. That rocket.
rocket is going right up into space. I'm running out of space to put all my things down now. Anything else, Freddie? Oh, that's a good picture. It's a robot. Have you got a toy robot at home? I'm sure some of you have. There's our robot. We've got so many things in our bag today. You've been very busy collecting them. Oh, now then, who can tell me what colour nail varnish it is? You know that I like painting my nails, don't you? And I nearly always have my nails this colour. What colour is it today? That's right, it's red. And I've even worn a red t-shirt as well today. I've got red nail varnish. I've got one more thing in here. Now, Freddie has been very busy doing lots of crafts while he's not been in Hetty. And he's made a rainbow. Look at that rainbow that Freddie's made out of beads. That is very clever, Freddie. Well done. We've got another rainbow. We have got another rainbow. The other rainbow we normally keep in our window, but we've taken it down to show you today. Would you like to see it? We have been really busy because this is the rainbow. Oh, shall I put it like a hat like this? There we go. That's funny, isn't it? This is the rainbow that we normally have in our window. Have you got a rainbow in your window? You might like to draw one and stick it in your window so everyone can see it when they walk past. That's our special rainbow. And it's got some sparkly bits on it as well. We had lots of fun, didn't we, Freddie, making that? Oh, yes, we have got one more thing to show you today. I wonder, can you see just there, there are some flowers. There's a very special flower. Let me see if I can get it for you. A very special friend of mine bought me these flowers. And this is a flower called a rose. It's a beautiful pink rose. And we thought we'd show you that rose today. Pop it back in the water because it's very hot and we don't want it to get too thirsty, do we? Right, shall we have a think of some of the things that we found today? There were lots and lots. Can you remember any of them? Let me have a listen. Shout them out to me. Wow, you remembered so many. Let's have a look. We've got a reindeer, a rubber, rhino, some ribbons, a rabbit, radio, raisins, a rocket, a robot, ruler, racket, rainbow and a rose. Did you hear the sound at the beginning of all those words? Have a listen again. Rainbow, rose, rocket, red. Can you hear that sound? That's right, it's a letter sound. R, r. We don't say r, 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 we say r. Shall I show you what it looks like? Let's see if it's in the box, I think it is. Here we go. This is the letter sound R. Now its real name is the letter R, but the sound it makes is an R. R. Can you do that sound? Let me have a listen. Well done, it's a tricky one, isn't it? On the back, we have got a picture of a robot. Can you see the robot has got his arms hanging over a little bit? Now then, when you see the letter sound R, we're going to pretend to be a robot. Let me show you how we'll do it. We go R, 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 R. Can you be a robot with me? R, 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 R. Well done. Shall we have a try at writing the letter sound R? Have you got your magic finger? Take your lid off, poof, pop 
pop it on the end. Here we go, we've got a special rhyme to say how we write the letter R. We say, down his back, then curl over his arm. Down his back, then curl over his arm. Should we try and write it on a board? Let's have a look. Now I know I've got a red pen in my bag here. Let's have a try. So I'm going to start at the top up here. Can you see? Are we ready? We're going to say, down his back, then curl over his arm. That's tricky doing that one, isn't it? Have another try. Down his back, then curl over his arm. I've got to do a tiny, tiny one now. Are you ready? Down his back, then curl over his arm. Oh, that wasn't very good. That was a bit rubbish, actually. Let me rub that one out. Try again. Down his back, then curl over his arm. Can you do it? Should we do a great big one now? Are you ready? Down his back, then curl over his arm. Wow, that is really huge. Well done, everybody. So today, we have learnt the letter sound R. Why don't you have a look around your house and see if you can find something that starts with the letter sound R. And we'll see you again next time. Where's Freddie gone? He's vanished. Come on, Freddie. Come and say bye-bye to the children. See you next time. Bye-bye.